Well, let's recap those headlines for you now. Chinese President Xi Jinping has delivered a keynote speech at the opening ceremony of the World Economic Forum's annual meeting in Davos. He called for a more inclusive globalization and stressed the importance of pursuing new models of global growth, cooperation, governance and development. Gambia's National Assembly has passed a resolution to allow President Yaya Jame to stay in office for three months from Wednesday, and that's according to Gambia State Television. The move came as Jame declared a state of emergency a day before his official mandate comes to an end. The move sparks uncertainty over Thursday's inauguration for the president-elect. A Nigerian Air Force jet on a mission against Boko Haram mistakenly bombed a refugee camp on Tuesday, killing scores of, refu of refugees and aid workers. Military Commander Major General Lucky Irabo confirmed an accidental, an accidental bombardment in the northeastern town of Ran near the border with Cameroon, saying some civilians were killed. President Muhammadu Buhari has called it, quote, a regrettable operational mistake. And African health activists have expressed concern that the incoming administration in the United States could spell doom for health programs on the African continent. The U.S. president's emergency plan for AIDS relief known as PEPFAR has over the years provided life-saving treatment to millions of people, including those in sub-Saharan Africa. Some fear this might not be for long. And that's a look at your headlines.